Om Namah Shivaya children. In today's video also we will continue with simple queries in SQL. In the previous video I have started conditions based on a range where we used the where clause to put the conditions for a range by using the keywords between and also not between. Today we will do the conditions based on a list where clause will be used here also but the keywords for finding values in a list will be in and also not in. So let us proceed with the video to see how to run the queries and get the output. So to learn conditions based on a list, the table we will be working with is the student table. We had been working with this table only. So let us see how the conditions based on a list work. Suppose we want to select the name of roll number name and uh, subject of those students whose subject is only commerce and arts or subject in the list commerce and arts only their name we have to see for that the command will be select so that's a condition that we mentioned that the condition should be subject should be either commerce or arts so select roll number roll number as it is given over there comma name comma say whatever you want to see what we can write say class and subject also right subject from student the table of the the table's name where subject in now the bracket will start over here you give the list under which the subject has to fall only that will be shown say commerce comma arts only this two name we want to see and close the bracket semicolon so see only roll number name class subject which columns we wanted to view those columns are shown from the table student where subject in what lists were mentioned commerce and arts so only commerce and arts students names are shown now let us see how does not in clause works or not in condition list works so for that we have to write select whatever when we want to see we will write so let's say say select a role underscore number role number we want to see name say only subject we want to see this time so subject from student the same table where say subject not in means the name that will be shown showing over here excepting those the others will be shown so suppose we don't want to see students who are in arts only arts students we don't want to see so put the arts in bracket so not in arts their names will be their roll number name and subject will be shown enter so you can see commerce and science roll number name and subject are written and arts not written why because we had mentioned subject not in arts not in the list arts so this is how the list works you can give long list according to your wish we mentioned the subject we can also change list differently like suppose let us learn few more queries you will get it clearly say say select star we want to see say all the columns so select star from student okay where say address this time we don't we are using the address whatever is the question according to you have to write so for, for example the question is we want to see all the columns of the table from the table student where address say not from Behala, Bata and Salt Lake those we don't want to see so address what will be it address not in what were the list given just write their name Behala we don't want to see this name so Behala Bata Salt Lake so belonging to this list their things won't be shown their details won't be shown no columns have been mentioned so all the columns will be shown so see leaving aside 
Dehala, Bata and Salt Lake. The other two that is Taratala, BBT Road and Mahishtala is shown. There all the columns are shown because no columns I had specified. So this is how the in and not in work. So children in the copy you have to write this base table on which we are learning in and not in. This is the query that you will write whose output is this first in and this is the query for not in that one's output is this one and another example of not in this query and this is the output so you have to write the base table then the then the first example of in and the query in for in and their output then not in that one's output and last another example of not in and that one's output so the more examples basically you will write children the more you will understand that how the queries are working okay so i hope you've learned or under and understood uh, the different types of in and not in i will share with you the pdf of the same thing that i've taught you so that you understand it easily the theory portions also next day we'll proceed with other sql query where we will learn few more condition based uh things okay children namaskar